Nah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Um, now August eleventh, um, you were driving in a Challenger, uh, with Chapo, your uh, your friend, right? Are y'all friends? Yeah, he's another he's another artist. You know, we grew up together. First of all, like that's my boy. Like I've been knowing him twelve years plus, just like everybody else in the Wolfpack. But um, okay, he's an artist. You know what I'm saying? He signed under my brother too. You know, in management deal with AD. So it's like we push him too. So he was with me that night when we were leaving the studio. Okay, and you were driving? Uh, yeah, I was driving. Hell yeah, yeah, I was driving. Okay, and you, so you're leaving the studio, and how long after the studio leaving the studio did the shots, you know, break out? Shit, I ain't no telling. It ain't no telling. The shit just, you know, it just popped off. It just happened fast. You feel me? But. It ain't like I wasn't on point or nothing. Like, I knew what it was, because if I wasn't on point, shit, I'd be dead right now. Man. That shit's crazy. Yeah, um, yeah. Hey, where were you shot at? Uh, I got hit, like, in my arm and shit. I got hit, like, three times. It was more like grazes and shit. You know, nothing really. Thank God it was like I had a shield on. Nothing went through, you know what I'm saying? But everything kind of just grazed me in my hand. You know, I got hit. Gray's like four or five times. Okay, and Chapo's fine too, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got hit one time in his back. But he's straight, you know okay. what I'm saying? We both, we both good, we're blessed. We bounce back, we're here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, nah, that's a, that's a blessing. Um, and was that your first time being shot? I mean, you know, yeah, pretty much. That's the first time, but it's like, it happens every day, you feel me? Like in the hood and shit, my brother's been shot every, like, it happens all the time, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, shit, I've already felt the pain from seeing my brothers go through it, my pops. So it was like something that was like more shocking, you feel me? Man, that, that shit is, uh, that shit, that's, that's fucked up, man, because you're doing your thing. And it's like, like you said before, you're just a bigger target now. Yeah, but you know, we built for this shit, Sean, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what other artists need to be built for that shit too. Like, if you out there and you rapping about this shit, you better be ready with what comes with it, you feel me? Ain't none of that folding, being nervous, none of that shit. Like, you got to know, like, shit, you got to be on point. You're a target. You're bigger now. You're getting money. You you in this industry. You know, people look up to you. Of course, it's going to be people trying to, you know, test your gangster or, or, or whatever the situation is. You just got to know how to bounce back and be ready for that. Yeah. So after being shot now, do you kind of look at, do you move differently? Do you look at life differently? Like, did it, does it change your outlook on... You know certain things? Not really. I mean, you know what I'm saying? It, it's the same thing. Like I say, like it happens every day. So it's like a shit. I was on point then. I'm on point now. Like we're gonna forever be like that. We're gonna move accordingly. Like that's that's just how that's how it goes. Whenever you in the industry, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, that's why I say it's two type of things. You could be in the street or you could be in the street. You feel me? And I I've, I come from the streets, but I don't plan on you know what I'm saying staying that way forever. Like I I just reach out to them and let them know, like, look, it's bigger things, you know what I'm saying? Own your own business, get this money, you know, get out the hood, get your family out the hood, you know? Cause it, not more or less because of the people, but because of, you know, how it is, the environment, the laws, everything. Yeah, man, cause like I said, I seen that and I was like, oh man, this guy, this guy stays, stays on the blogs, man. It's like, this guy's a target. Like, what is this guy? What is what is what is Brick doing to piss people off in Houston? Yeah. Nah, it ain't never nothing personal. You know what I'm saying? If it is, you know, shit, we ready for that, but it ain't it ain't never nothing personal. Everything, you know, it's love on our end to everybody out there that's that's making it happen and doing their thing. You feel me? I just it's, it's a situation shit be popping off like that. Just gotta be ready. <laughs>